Grace and peace be unto you from God our Father and from the Lord Jesus Christ. Here we are celebrating another year, Women's Mother's Day rather, but it's also Women's Day because we're not just celebrating mothers because there are many people who are not biological mothers, but they are women indeed. I'm celebrating all of you who are leaders, who are female leaders. I celebrate you because you are not only mother, perhaps in your own family, but also in your church family. So I'm hailing from the International Gathering at Beth Rafa, and I'm speaking to Beth Rafa and to the Rafa Alliance, to the women, happy Mother's Day. Thank God for your prayers. Thank God for your patience. Thank God for your kindness. Thank God for your correction. In this pandemic, you were asked to endure many difficulties. In this pandemic, it became wearisome at times. But thank God he brought you through. So I want to wish you happy Mother's Day, happy Women's Day. Happy to all the female members of our church that God will sustain you, that God will lift you up. You're not a second class citizen. You have been carved out by God. He always had you on his mind. You are created in his image. And we thank God that he loves us continually. We are etched in the palm of his hands. We are fearfully and wonderfully made. Receive that when the tears are running down. Receive that when the days are weary. Receive that when there are lonely times. Receive that when you're discouraged. Receive that when you've been abandoned. Receive that when you've been ignored. Receive the love of God when you've been rejected. And just remember, he has never left you alone and will never leave you alone or ignore you. Happy Mother's Day.